pulling up, ready for anything, anyone, know that I get it done, in the bands, I be pulling up, tell your friends, cause I'm pulling up. Oh my God, today we're gonna to look at four star defensive play for Ricardo Steamboat. We got Triple H, he's gonna make four more power gems on every toy, okay? You see right here, so every one turn he's making a sweet five. This is a glitch. It doesn't make seven power gems into yellow. It's going to be three. That's a visual glitch. Don't let them fool you. Don't let them get to you. We got the finisher, destroy a one by two area. I think it becomes more at four star, whatever that is. I'm going to find out with you because I'm going to be watching with you. And um, we got Nakamura, three star bronze Nakamura. He adds 45% more on each attack. I'm assuming when he's at 5k, it'll be 50% more, but I'm not sure. Don't take my word for it. Do your research. As a matter of fact, as I watch the video with you, I could probably hook you up with the numbers. So let's get into it, guys. Let's see what's popping with Ricardo Steamboat, okay? Alright, so we see off the bat, off the cuff, boom, five power gems, okay? He's going to put all of them on yellow. I guess that's his steez, not me. I will put them between the yellow since it can only make three power gems into yellow gems. So I would try to finagle a wild card match or a row break or a column break. But you know, to each day own, you know, I don't judge. I don't judge. Let's see what's going on here. Boom, every turn he's doing 2506 damage. That's thanks to the Shinsuka Nakamuka boost. Okay, 45% on top. Now I mean, a little profit, a little bonus. Now he's filling between the yellows. He's filling between the yellows. Tell me how you really feel. All right, boom. Look at Batista's life. It's draining, it's draining, it's painful. He don't know how to handle it. Bang. There's, there's no Bray Wyatt to boost black move, so every turn, Batista's taking that work. Batista is taking that work. Look at his life. It's deplorable. It's depressive. Okay, he, Batista has a submission move at four star. It's very annoying. It's very annoying. It's gonna set us back a little bit, but nevertheless, look at his life. Look at his life. So yeah, at 5k, Nakamura would give his power gems a 50% boost. Okay? Okay. Pay attention. Arm drag. Put it over the blast gems. None of that foolishness. So we can use his one turn power gems uh, more defensively to take down the opponent's offense. You know, keep the odds ever in our favor. These are our hunger games. Batista's not here for the foolishness, given that blast gem work. Look at his life. Now you see, had not for Batista's submission move, he would have been dead, because he would have hit the finisher and um destroying that, that area. Let me let me let me check the facts. Let me check the car facts to see how much damage his finisher does at four star. At four star, the finisher destroys a three by four area and does approximately 23K damage. So it would have been a wrap. It would have been a Reynolds. It would have been a do-rag. But Batista, because he has that low charge submission move, he's given us that wake. But in my opinion, despite what we see going on here, I prefer the defensive build of one Ricardo Steamboat and I would advocate this over the offensive build because those power gems are going to be kicking butt that's that let me know your thoughts in the comments on if you prefer the offensive build or the defensive build of Ricardo Steamboat David Diab Ready or not, I'll be pulling up. Remember, they said I'm not good enough. I took all the energy, turned it to greatness. Now look at my life, man, it's looking amazing. I'm ready for anything, anyone. I've been so ready for. <laughs>